Okay, so you're given the equation of the line in standard form. Remember, standard form is ax plus by plus c is equal to zero. And we have to figure out the value of c. But we can't solve this if we don't know other um, variables, if we don't know the value for the other variables. But then we're told that this line passes through this point, 1, 2. How do you read a coordinate? How do you label a coordinate? X and Y. That's how you label a coordinate, right? Do you see an X and Y in your equation? If I replace these X and this X and this Y, then I'm only left with one unknown. Can I then solve for C? What does A... X mean? What operation? If you have two variables next to each other, what's the operation? Multiply. So let's fill it in. 3 times X. What's X? What's the value of X in the question? Plus 4. What's the value of Y? 2. We're using this coordinate, X and Y. We're just replacing X and replacing Y plus C. I don't know C. The question says find C equals zero. Simplify it. What's three times one? What's four times two? Plus C equals zero. Can you add these together? What's three plus eight? Eleven plus C equals zero, but I need to isolate C. What do I have to do with that positive eleven? Negative 11. So C is equal to, because if I take 11 away, I get rid of it. So I have to take 11 away. So C is equal to negative 11. Okay, this time I'm giving you the equation, but you have to find A. You know C this time. You have to find A, and you're given X and Y. So you're going to replace your X and your Y. A times, what's X? 1 plus 2 times, what's y? Zero. zero. Take away 5 equals 0. We're just rewriting the equation. How would I write a times 1? You can write 1a, or you can just write a. So this question is actually easy, easier because a is isolated. What is 2 times 0? Take away 5. What's nothing take away 5? Negative 5. So we have A take away 5 equals 0. What's the opposite of take away 5? Plus 5. That's how you get rid of it. So we have to add 5 to that side. So we've isolated A because we know that 1A and A is the same thing, right? You don't have to, if you put a 1 in front, it doesn't change it. What's 0 plus 5? That's the final answer, A equals 5.